world has been your battlefield. Everywhere you go, the blood of brothers and sons. If you're looking for a good Christmas gift for your teenage son this year, look no further than Modern Warfare 2. The game was the top seller in November and almost pulled up a down year in the gaming market. It sold 4.2 million for Xbox and 1.9 million for PlayStation so far. There was a launch event held in New York City which featured music by Questlove and DJ Jazzy Jeff. At the premiere, Jerry Hairston of the New York Yankees and Cole Hamels of the Philadelphia Phillies challenged each other with the game. Hairston hoped to get better, but Hamels wanted revenge. I am very much looking forward to, the, to this launch of Modern Warfare 2. I know the first one was, was, was sick. I uh, wasn't very good at it, but uh, I'm looking to get better at, at, in the second one. You know, I know uh, Cole is a competitor. I have faced him uh, a number of times, and you know, obviously I, I'm hoping he, he's not much of a gamer so I can take him. You know, I think uh, if I can't beat him on the field, I, hopefully I can beat him on the, uh, on the network here. Ice-T said that he was waiting for the game just like everyone else. Activision had me come up to a suite about a month and a half ago and I got to play the game. But I don't own it yet, so I'm here tonight to pick up my copy and I'll be online with everybody else tonight. Modern Warfare 2 was the number one video game in the UK for six straight weeks and it shattered the record set by Halo 3 for sales in one month.